How's it going everybody? Ableton Certified Trainer Brian Funk here with a little two minute tip. Right now I'm building some Juno 106 instruments for my music production club. I'm making 40 of them and I've sampled eight octaves of this beautiful synth and now I have to map all of the root notes and it's very time consuming but I've got a little trick that might make it a little quicker. I figure 40 times 8 is 240 times I have to do this so the faster I can make it the quicker I can get done and get this out to my people. So, when I've got Sampler open here, I can just go right to the note I want my root to be, hold down the Option key, and do a click, and it moves that little R all the way here. And that's the root key down here as well. Otherwise, you could go to your next sample, click on it, and then move this to C1, and go to the next sample. This takes too long, though. So instead, I'm just going to hover to where I want the root note to be, Option click, these are all C's, so I'm just going to continue to option click and do my last one. Now I can click on my samples, right click them, we'll select all, then we'll right click them, distribute root notes around key, and now they are all in the place where they need to be. And what I like to do is just click on each one and look down here at the root key and make sure they're in the right spot, hit the down arrow as I go through. Everything looks good, and I can move on to the next batch. And real quick, I'm just going to click where I need these. All C's. Moving up the octaves. I'm going to select all here. And distribute around root key. Double check. Everyth oh, I made a mistake. So I would double check. And everything else is looking pretty good. So I hope that helps, really speeds up my workflow and allows me to do 240 samples in the root key really quickly. Thanks for watching.